A student-centered classroom is dynamic. It is changing. It's not just about me pursuing things I want to know about. It's about my students pursuing things they want to know about. Each time the content is engaged with the professor and with the students, it's going to be different. It's going to be dialogic. It's, it's part of a dialogue between the teacher and the students. Gardner Webb is a place where we as teachers will take a personal interest in you, in helping you to pursue and hopefully successfully achieve your goals in life. Dr. Morgan has always made special effort to ask me about my family and how my day is going. The faculty here are so compassionate and they care about the students. It's really very simple. It goes down to the intangibles. You know, pay attention to the student. It's not about me in the classroom. Dr. Eddins really does make it a point to get to know her students, and she's always willing. She tells us at the beginning of the semester, she's always willing to sit and talk with you. And I think those qualities are representative of the faculty at Garden Web. I feel like they really do offer opportunities for all of their students. If a college education is three hours a week listening to one person talk, we can replicate that on the internet. We don't need colleges anymore if it's information being sent out there for people to just listen passively. What I can do that can't be replicated by the internet is get students into the archives, into the primary source data, which is my field, history, or in the case of the hard sciences, into the labs, doing the actual process of mastering something themselves for the very first time. When I first began teaching, I mainly relied on the lecture approach. And while I appreciate the value of the lecture approach, I've since come to learn, mainly through the influence of my colleagues, that there are also other approaches that can be at least as effective, maybe even more effective. As I progressed in my teaching career, I think I have become more student-centered. For example, I always want to know who are they? Where do they come from? What do they want to get out of the class? What is their professional goal? Students tell me that they really appreciate the idea that their energy is driving the learning. I want to be a college professor and I want to treat my students the way that I've been treated here because I don't think there's any better way to be a professor than what I've seen here.